the uh, shortest queue time possible. But that's not true at all. Because it's matchmaking based on your... I don't remember what it's based on, but... I'm pretty sure it's based on KD or something. Because if I, even if I queue a teammate, they're gonna be like level 9. Like, even if I do kill a teammate, they're just gonna be completely worthless and they're just gonna fall over. They're actually just gonna be like sweet sponges. The balance is it based on like your level mixed with your KD or some weird Like, I'll actually get brand new players on my team. Like, you can look at arenas. Like, your arenas does the same fucking thing. You literally solo queue arena and you get a level 7 on your team, dude. Yeah, I mean, that's great and all, but I'd, like, it's not, it's not my point. My point is, even if I were to fill my team, I'm still going to be put against these bloody three stacks that are all on comms while I'm solo, and my two teammates are also solo. That's, that's my point. There's nothing wrong with playing PUBG with friends. What's wrong is the matchmaking, putting solo players into games with other three stacks. You shouldn't be able to play by yourself and then get put against a team that's fully on comms. Even if you're auto-filling and having teammates, that you shouldn't be against teams that are fully on comms while you're with randoms. Not how it should be. Yes, if you run solo, you should be matched with other squads that are solo. There's no reason that I should be put against three kids who are playing on f One PC player, two console players that are on f on comms, sweating off like there's 300 million dollars on the line there's no point it, it just it makes making content for the game really hard monotonous and overly difficult for going? no reason we don't need seat belts. if they made a solo mode certain characters would just straight suck they just need to make it so that like if you queue solo only other solo players will be queued into your game and i don't mean i don't mean no fill i mean if you're queuing by yourself even if you have fill on it will only be other champion. solos in that lobby so everyone has random you teammates what is that mm, <clears throat> called mercenary playlist called out it yeah exactly That should just be how the game is. If you're a duo, then cool, you can get put into the three stack pools. If you're three stacking, well, obviously you know where you belong. If you're solo, you should only be a solos. I, I literally don't have a problem with people playing with their friends. I encourage it even. Because the game needs that. The most content creators are at such a high skill level in this game that in order to actually make fun to watch content. What is that? Is this kid playing on dial up what is that what is this is this guy still in the corner what, what is this uh, bro 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 what is this what am i what am i playing against right now what are you As I was saying, most like content creators in this game are at such a high skill level that we can't play with friends and make good content because it'll just be boring to watch and boring to play because we won't be able to have fun because like lobbies will just die. Because what's fun, oh. What people want to see is their favorite content creator getting 20 bombs, dropping high damage games, that. You can't do that when you play with your friends. You're like both really, really good. Almost intentionally trying to farm, right? Solo, like that's just boring. Where this guy's teammate just go? All the way over there? Dead. Recharging shields. 
for Fade's content is the thing I watch. Well, there's a difference between people like Fade and people that are like pro players trying to make content, right? Because Fade's content just looks extremely flashy, whereas pro players are all about efficiency. Like, Fade's a flashy player. So are the people that he plays with. They're, they're all flashy, but it's not efficient when it comes to actually like, being competitive. So it's easy to entertain viewers by doing extremely flashy things like random little movements like this and like doing weird ring. Ooh, maybe time for a snack. It looks really cool to people that don't know better. Whereas if you have three pro players stacking trying to farm fucking pub content, it's gonna be boring as shit because we're all just they're just doing efficient movements. I'm not going for anything super crazy. Now, I'm not like, I'm not talking fade by saying that. I'm literally just that's how it is. He said it himself. Like it's, I'm pretty sure he said it himself. A lot of shit does is unnecessary. It looks really nice. Like it's, there's a difference between being really flashy and being really efficient. Like look at Hal for example. Hal's like the least flashy player in the game, but he's extremely efficient. Yeah, I mean no disrespect to fade. He knows that. I played with him before, and they were cool. Like, imagine if me, Hal, and Jordan are three stacking pubs. That's going to be the most boring f***ing video you'll ever watch. Or if me, Snipe Down, and Hal are like, me, Tom, and Brandon. Like, it'll, it'll be so boring. Isn't that why it's so much fun to watch three stack ranked? It's fun to watch three stack ranked because people in that are actually like, it's different. There's more, there's like something on the line in ranked. It's not like, it's like gaining RP and like you're playing against people that are all like actually trying really hard. But if like three pros, three stack pubs, you're going to be thrown against random solo players like myself. Like I'm solo queuing right now. Perfect example earlier, brother Enoch is solo queuing fucking arenas and got put against me sweet and fun, dude. I don't know what I'm doing after champs. Yeah, I've talked about it on stream before. I literally don't know what I'm doing after champs. I might f just go full content creator and just start doing variety shit and doing whatever I want. I might still play Apex. I might, I might keep competing. I don't f know what I'm doing after chance. <clears throat> Sounds depressed today. I'm just tired. playing Destiny 2. I played it a long time, or a long time ago. Not really my thing. Ever miss Blackout? That game was goaded. In all seriousness, that game was so f***ing good. Blows my mind that that shit died as uh, easily as it did. It was so good. Oh, hey. Way down. Just 
Gotta take down the last squad. Sole survivor. Turn the rub totem, bro. Are you up? Mayday. Crashing and burning over here. Flames up. Thank you. 